<coughs> it's that time of the year again, and I guess we've got to go pumpkin picking. Uh, let's do it. It's October and the pumpkins are out, so let's go pick them. I know I'm sounding so enthusiastic about this. First things first, you're gonna want something to carry the pumpkins in. So they do wheelbarrows here, or you could be strong like ox and carry them yourself. If you do come, you're gonna need gloves and you will need like some boots because it is a field and you will get mud everywhere. So bring a change of shoes and bring some gloves. As you go in, you will see like a photo display area and they have a pile of pumpkins. You can pick some of these if you want, but the field, that's where you want to go, is get into the field, look at them. They're just wild pumpkins and you can just go look at them and pick which ones you want to pick. So naturally, the mission is to find the largest pumpkins here. Um, we're going to buy by the barrow, which is like £37 or so. Um, and I guess we're going to fill it up. So I'm looking for something nice. I mean, look at them. They're just, they're just like, it's like nature. I don't know. Fields, isn't it? This has slowly become a yearly thing I've done. I did this last year as well. And I think I got like, how many pumpkins? Like 44 pumpkins last time. But this year, I decided to go for really big ones because um, carving 40 pumpkins is difficult. So, but look at them. Look at that. That's just like, such a classic pumpkin. Um, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just so shocked with nature, you know? Let me know if this is something you would do yourself and if you find it exciting. Um, I know I do. So we're going to try and find some interesting colored ones because obviously there's orange, but there's also like white pumpkins and you get green ones too and they get really small ones. So we're going to go um, and find a few different choices. This farm is called Stanhill Farm and I'll leave a link to it in the description. Um, been here a couple of times and I, I quite enjoy it. It's a very large like field. It's a couple, it's a couple of different fields, not just one. Um, and they also do like corn and um, they do what's it strawberries they do marrows cucumbers they do like a different kind of pick your own kind of varieties depending on the year so you might be asking why come and pick your own pumpkins well i think it's like an activity so you know it's something to do rather than going to the supermarket and picking it up and they were like oh yeah I'll just get one you can come here and have a look you don't have to rush you don't have to be like i'm gonna you know get in get one and get out uh, you can take your time uh, obviously they're not all going to be clean they are like wild nature now, pumpkin picking is one of them things where there isn't much to do besides pick pumpkins. So if you're looking for excitement and maybe some games, uh, pumpkin picking probably isn't the best. However, if you want pumpkins, it's the perfect place to come. And they don't just have one type, they have multiple types. Green ones, red ones, white ones, and we're going to find some there. Now, you might be asking how much does all this cost? Well, the cool thing is you can get a whole wheelbarrow full of pumpkins, mixed colours, for about £37. It's just one of the fields. There's like three different fields and you can choose the best ones if you wish to or you can choose the worst looking ones that is completely up to you first pumpkin in it's a green watermelon looking one but it's not a watermelon wow that's tiny i love it i want it in fact i'm getting it look at it yes gosh this is huge that's massive and this is the haul. We haven't gone for loads and loads, but just gone for a different few colors there. That's that really big one that I struggled to lift. Thank you very much for watching this video of um, pumpkin picking. Uh, I guess I, I might make another one for carving them. I don't know yet, I haven't decided. And of course, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you want to, and I'll catch you on the next one. Goodbye.